I'm going to bookmark this, yeah. uh, this soundboard. That seemed useful. This is the oh, I'm not tired anymore. Oh, yeah, sorry. I don't know what you want to do. I'm going to go and sleep anyway. They're registered with the capital line. Do the Mario. Swing your arms from side to side. Come on, it's time to go. Do the Mario. Do the tired Mario. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, do the Mario. All right, guys. Do the Mario. That was, those are awesome live auctions, but I just want to remind everybody that we have an amazing silent auction going right now. In just a second. Okay. As soon as Kathleen is done talking. Cool. As soon as I'm done talking, we're going to do a giveaway. So I'm just going to say this really quickly. Right now, one of the items up for silent auction is you and a Hijinx and Sue comic. Uh, Hijinx and Sue, drawn by Joel Watson, is going for the low, low, undervalued price of $175. So if you just want to get in there and snipe in... On that, I think that's an excellent lot. You will join a geeky pantheon you know, of people who have been in that comic. You and Will Wheaton will have been in Hijinks and Sue. Maybe not in the same comic, but you can say that you've been drawn. So I think that's a really cool bit lot, and I think that you guys should bid on that. You also get an 11 by 17 print of you in the comic as well. So it's not just a digital thing. You get a physical thing which you can hang and frame that's on awesome. your That's awesome. You get yeah. in the comic and you get a print of that comic. Yes. That's super cool. And thank you to Liz. Who's gone Ow. upstairs for because she is friends with Joel and has coordinated that for us. So thank you, Liz. Yay! So Matt, did you say Jeff is calling at 7:30 now? 7:15. Oh, 7:15. <laughs> <laughs> we have another. Oh, we have a very special call in 20 minutes. Ah, nice to meet you. Yeah. Nice to meet you. So, 3:05. To, Your shirt to 3 to We should mention that we have a very special call coming at 4 o'clock. At 4 o'clock our time. Okay. The winner of the Mario Brothers button patch giveaway thing is... Admiral Mimo. Admiral Mimo. Congratulations. Who has a donor account and a public name and everything. Awesome! Yay! Get that stuff sent to you. Thank you so much. Hello, Trimester. So, um, <coughs> Hello, the only person out there who cares about me. Oh, oh, yeah. Apparently. Mail, 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 mail. Well, he just said hi, and he's a character. Wait, that's the wrong email. Bye, Beesh. Sleep well, Beesh. Sleep well, Beesh. Bye, Beesh. Someone said that that should be your team, though. Someone actually had them all there. I think it was that. I'm just going to show this to the chat. Because apparently it's really freaking hard. Well, it's the situation or more the people. This is not, so this is, this is not an auction. Ruth just wants to show you this awesome thing she did. I was lying in the back. Um, yeah, this is had some history to it. The last time I came to Desert Bus was in 2009, two years ago, and I doodled a picture, but I never finished it until right now. It's going into Nice. So, anybody who remembers 09, that was the year of cat ears, and those are the four drivers. So, zoom in a bit on the uh, on the. This, this, was, this was Morgan. Morgan with his weird <laughs> duo hawk. It had a name. I, love I don't the, remember. I love, the Bill can't, I love that Bill can't there. fit in the bus. And there's Roscoe. And Bill does not fit in the bus yet. And that's Jane with socks on him. So. Oh, wow. Someone sent me another soundboard to use. Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye. Uh, Sarcasm self-test complete. <laughs> nice. Sweet. Uh, someone Fox, I forget who it was, who said about the Nano Rhino things. I put the winners up on the blog. The, the winner and uh, two or three runners up. I'm not putting them all on the blog because there's like hundreds of them, and it would be there all day. Yeah. No, there's like 250 entries. Yeah. But I put the ones that were noteworthy and good and were chosen by Kate last night. But I forgot to post them because I, I was, like, I think I breathed in too much paint thinner because I had to go meet the the people on the other side of the world. I was like, hang on. Yeah, King Cool has been working very hard in our blog lines. Not really that hard. Pretty hard. I could be working harder if you guys send us more milestone picks. Wait. But I don't think you guys have the guts. Where in Portal 2 is this quote? I didn't hear this. Which one? If you had underwear and a butt, I'd pull your underwear right up your butt. That's where Portal 2? That's so weird. I don't think so. 
No, oh, 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 that's the adventure sphere. Yeah, it's core number two, yeah. Yeah. I just yeah. guess I didn't hear that particular quote when I was playing. We, wait, when is our next, when is our call in 15 minutes? Our, we've got a call in in 50 minutes at 4 o'clock, and that's Grant Imahara is calling from Mythbusters. Did you guys catch that? 4 yes. o'clock. We hit 90. I gotta go change the plug. Yeah, Away. one of those donations has definitely come in because we are we have just skyrocketed up above, up above ninety one. And I also just got a request from someone else who's calling in a little later on, Yahtzee. Oh. Just sent his request, so now he's ready to go when our time is. When's Yahtzee calling in? He's not actually calling in until eight p.m. Pacific. Uh, so 8 p.m. Eight our time. We also have a variety of delightful prizes to auction off while Yahtzee's on the line. We have some really cool zero punctuation stuff. And uh, while we're just killing time, because we have a call in about 15 minutes. I'm going to murder this time. This <laughs> delightful tomb. Oh my goodness. That's tonight, isn't it? That's tonight. This is the oh. first of the hottest... Can I? Spiciest magic auctions that we oh, have donated oh, by Wizards no. of the Coast. Oh. These are the most amazing things. Let's, let's. <laughs> we're not going to pull it out yet. This is the all foil uncut sheet of cards from Innistrad. Like these. Did you oh, catch that? This is, <laughs> we'll repeat that. This is an all foil sheet of cards from Innistrad uncut. You can't buy this. Anywhere, like I don't like. We could not put a val like approximate value on this because yeah. I've never even heard of this being auctioned off. It's Wizards not something they sell. So incredibly. They generous. had. They had. They had. Uh, they. Ha I think they had an uncut M12 sheet that they were using as a grand prize at PAX. You are correct. But yeah. But the, what? But it wasn't. It, it, it wasn't. It, 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 no. it, 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 it was. Was it foil? Was it foil? Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Foil and this is. This is paint. something you can only get. From from wizards, yeah, yes. um, yeah. So it's 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 eleven cards by eleven cards with like printing, like with like the whole crop marks on the outside and stuff. Yes, this is a sheet of commons and land. Commons. Yeah, land. this is this is if you really care, it's common slash land run number one from uh, from the latest expansion in Estrad. We have a common sheet that we're auctioning tonight. We have an uncommon sheet Which that we're, we're auctioning, auctioning on, on Tuesday, Tuesday night. night. We have a rare and mythic sheet that we're auctioning on Wednesday night. And they're all uncut foil sheets from Innistrad. And y I want to steal them all. There's no way we can afford these. If, no. If I may these say, are amazing. I'm not even going to show you right now. could not contain the excitement I feel over that auction. And no kidding. pretty big too. Yeah. So if you, guys know, if you guys know some people who run card shops or who just like collecting swag, maybe just get a hold of them and say what's going, what's being auctioned tonight because these are very spicy. They're not playable because they're uncut. These are <laughs> these are collector's items only. The but worst the, thing you could do is cut this up. <laughs> yeah. But if you do, we want to see it. Yeah. yeah. There's uh, there's pictures of it on the blog. I'm not going to unsheath the awesome now, but it's pretty awesome. Just saying. Just so that's that lots there. of time to set up a donor <clears throat> account and have it signed up. Also, the chat. Yes, also. Be prepared. Be so you have. Okay. Seriously. Serious lots. All, it's very important. It's five o'clock. About five o'clock. After Grant Imahara phones in. Also, apparently, Lily Scaldaferry, or uh, author of Name Game, is on her way on the bus. Yes. She's like, can somebody get me from the ferry? And I'm like, we are all very busy. You're going to have to take the bus. I'm really sorry, Lily. She's like, no, that's, uh, that's legit. That's very legit. I will see you there. She said, uh, uh, waiting to get on a bus to go to Desert Bus. There is a metaphor in there somewhere. And our friend Cam, who was here yesterday, responded in the only, <coughs> in the only way possible, which is, yo dog, we heard you like to bus. <laughs> so we put Twitter in yo bus so you can transmit while you transit. Uh, <laughs> so Daniel, how's it going? Pretty good. How's your driving? <coughs> good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, you got your bug spot going. You got everything Enjoy. nicely lined up. I got this duck on my uh, leg here. Yeah, excellent. Keeping you company. Keeping everything on. Roscoe's a cool dude. He is. Ooh, is there more coke here? He doesn't afraid hey, of anything. I'll you Thank you. That'd be wonderful. The uh, he's the child of two wizards and a comet. Yeah. Oh. He was. Yeah. We determined that once. <laughs> in one of in what is still one of my favorite pieces of Desert Bus fan art ever, is the. Uh, is it? I believe if you actually were Google, they wizard ducks. Nope, they were just wizards. It was two wizards and a comet. Wait, what about Roscoe P. Jingles the third? That's the one. Yeah. 
What happened? What about him? If you, uh, if you been, Google some revisionist history, if you Google Roscoe P. Jangles, he got oh. retconned. Isn't that amazing? I, actually, it wasn't. It wasn't two wizards. It was just wizards and a comet. Oh right, right, right. Wizards and a comet. Undisclosed comment. number of wizards. That is just wow. who did so that? cool. Uh, this is linked off off of their DeviantArt page. Let me find out. Yeah, Thank right. you so much. This so the, 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 the polar bear oh, thing that Coke is doing sure. really confused me the other day. Because I was like, I'll have a Coke, please, and they handed me this. I'm like, oh, not, not not a not diet, diet, not a diet Coke. And they were like, no, no, that's not diet. That's oh, it's, a, it's that's, all white. Yeah. That's their support of it's the, the polar, polar bears. bears. Yeah. Oh. So sure. go go polar bears. Well, that, that can be a real problem for diabetic people. I've had a few diabetic friends grab a regular Coke thinking it's diet. Well, um, Pepsi did the same thing. Their caffeine-free diets used to be blonde, and their regular diets were white. Now the caffeine-free diets are white, and something else is some other color. And they they just they just love messing with us because they're like. We know you don't need your sugar water. We're gonna mess it up. It, what we're saying is that they're villains. So, uh, hey, we're gonna have. Um, sorry, later tonight when we auction that uh, comment sheet off, we're gonna have uh, Wizards community manager Mike Robles uh, call in during the auction to to tell us uh, to tell you how he got all this amazing stuff for us. When is when is that gonna happen? That's later tonight. I hope we get involved some sort of. Jewel I'm, heights. I'm looking for the schedule. I think it's on the next year. Seventeen hundred. So that's five o'clock. Five o'clock. Because he's got a challenge in for us too, which we could maybe do after that. Oh, that's true. While he's watching, because he will at that point for sure be, uh, for sure be watching. Um, the DeviantArt page is broken orange, so I'm not sure. But yeah, broken dash orange That's the person who did the amazing Roscoe P. Jangles fan art from <laughs> Desert Bus Three. Was it three? Yeah, it was because it was in the Woo! second, oh, the nice. second moon base. And I came in the next day, and I was like, I, like I looked at the email when it came in, and I was like, what is this? Like it's an awesome, it's like it's amazing, but what? And then yeah, because I wasn't, I hadn't been around for when it was determined that Roscoe was the offspring of wizards and the comet. Yes. I touch chair, and I don't know everything. I don't know where you got that impression. Yeah. Garbage day. Garbage day. Hey, you have some of a voice. You have, you, yeah, you have. Aspects of a voice now. <laughs> I have like, I don't know, Big 15 gave me voice. cigarettes. The amazing morning show that he hosted last night. What? <laughs> the Derp yeah. Line. Ah, yes, the, the Derp, derp Line. Derp which line? we will probably be getting requests to do again. Nice. That he was, was over in. He was over in the booth there. And Camera on him, taking no. phone calls. He spoke of Michael and he oh added God. us to Skype. Yes, because I told him how to do that. Uh, I don't know, I don't... I don't think I do have a cold, actually. I did briefly for a couple days. I was seemed like I was going to get be getting something, but I didn't. Uh, my voice sounds like this because Desert Bus. Oh. Yeah. Mike says he's been watching all day. Yay, Mike! You're awesome. Mike intends to be here next year, by the way. He had better be. No, seriously. He would have been here this year, but apparently California doesn't believe he exists. Um, he lives in Seattle, but he's from California, and there's a passport thing. He's dealing with it. Murph, why do you bring up uh, Ripley's Believe It or Not, The Little Master Lou? And Kathleen. I don't Oh my it. god, my dad worked on that game. He did? Oh, I wrote an FAQ for that. Did you seriously? <laughs> yes! That's a world. Wow, that's so weird. Sanctuary, I know the, uh, Woods was the uncut in, uh, sheet is in the live yes, auction dad, section. My dad used I'll to link to it here. Beautiful. Well, not really, but... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, that place was a hole. Oh, well, actually, it looks yeah. like those actually have time towns, so that's good. Ripley was a good game. Well, it was, that's not the info section, right? Ni hao, Mr. Kettling. Yeah, this is the top of the live auction section. Okay, good. They're displaying times for me. Yes. On a 24-hour clock, local time. Fuji Man. What? Uh, there's a $50 challenge here for you to... Oh, after 5 p.m.? Okay. Uh, a stirring rendition of Don't Stop Believing, starring Matt and another person. That, 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 no. that, that, that is accomplished. All right, marked as I don't know if it was stirring, though. It, I was pretty stirring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially yeah, D &D. I was, I was a little shaken. shaken. Peter, you're on fire. Daniel, you okay Matt's if I go get a drink and see yes. you bust for a bit seven. longer? Yep. You, Sweet. Sure. you think you got a handle on it? Peter, you're fired. Yeah. Oh, wow. A $150 challenge to reenact... Or video give in. 
with me playing. Oh goodness. Well, we'll give in. Oh, I'll try. Well, give in is the one 